Good evening viewers and thanks for joining us once again. Uh, just a bit of um, shameless plug before we uh, proceed with the, today's video. Um, some of our merchandise we've got for sale at the moment. Um, we've got our, um, our t-shirts here with our Midcoast logo on the front there and uh, on the back um, we've got our logo with the uh, Drift Drag and Pro Street Specialists. Um, we've got some hats here. Um, we've got our normal peak and your flat peak hats. Um, naturally, all uh, genuine, like the parts we use, all genuine, genuine flex fit, um, flex fit caps. Um, got our logo on the front there, on the back, uh, Pro Street Specialists on the back there. Um, once again, very good hats, very good quality. Uh, got some stubby holders, free stubby holder with everybody that makes a purchase of our merchandise. Um, so keep that in mind. Um, got stubby holders there. Um, got our hoodies once again with our logo on the front. We've got zip ups. Um, we've got zip ups and we've also got uh, just your uh, kangaroo pocket style. Um, Blank, blank hoodie on the front there. Uh, got our logo naturally on the on the um, just some cleaning instructions. Uh, got our logo on the front there. Once again, zip up hoodie, um, one of my favourites. Uh, and uh, once again on the back, we got our um, our mid coast logo. And uh, once again, Drift Dragon Pro Street Specialist. So uh, there we go. Alrighty. So um, if you'd like to order some merchandise, um, I'll put a link in the comments down below to our Facebook page. Um, if you can't get in contact with us, just leave a comment in the comments down below, and I'll try and get back to you. Um, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe. Really um, stoked with uh, how it's all going, and um, yeah, just let the uh, the channel progress a bit more. So. Um, uh, once again, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe. If you'd like to get um, hold of some of our merchandise, just get in contact with us and we can send it to you Australia-wide. Alrighty, let's get on with today's video. Alrighty, so something a little bit different. Um, on our way to the Chucktober or um, the Chrysler Charger uh, anniversary, 50th anniversary of the Charger. Um, so yeah, something that uh, the Chrysler Car Club have put on. Um, sorry for all you interstate guys that aren't able to make it. I know there's heaps of Charger guys out there that, um, yeah, it's really unfortunate you guys couldn't make it, but you know, due to COVID, what can we say? Um, but um, yeah, so hopefully there'll be a really good turnout today. Um, yeah, catch up with a heap of guys and stuff. So uh, yeah, I'll, um, I'll try and do a little bit of footage today and um, yeah, just uh, see how we go. Alrighty, enjoy the day. Alrighty, so down here at the uh, at the uh, Charger Festival, looks like a few cars rocking in already. Got the boys over here, Maddie and Wayne and, and uh, Simon. So yeah, really good to see. Um, yeah, quick pan around. Got the car down here looking, yeah looking pretty dirty to be quite honest but anyway so I haven't given it a clean for a while but uh, yeah we'll get into that in a minute alrighty quick pan around we've got uh, Clem Smith's uh, Clem Smith's beast up there that Jason Maros has been um, campaigning and uh, and uh, driving a little bit of, of, of late since he's freshened up the motor etc on the car so yeah really good alrighty just a quick pan around <laughs> John, how you going, man? They just get a little bit rattly, that's a bit all that rattly, happens. Yeah, I was just saying, we just 
put another motor in. Yeah. It's, it's a little bit rattly, but ah, it's not rattling. It ain't working. Well, you know, that <laughs> one was too hot, too canned, and that. This was like, I can't cruise it. I'm yeah. Vital. Yeah. Pain in the ass. Yeah. yeah. and all of our supporters and members of Adelaide's Coast of Ambon. As I said before, we're down here at the Charger 50th anniversary celebration. We're going to play your tune right now by Blue Swede, Hooked on the Feeling, and then we're going to have a very interesting interview. Yeah. Uh, what sort of, uh, what sort of dollars involved to make that price? Good job. Uh, what's the job? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Okay, so something pretty cool. Um, got my E55 here, um, and it's pretty unusual to have like six parked within the same vicinity within less than a few meters of each other. So um, yeah, we'll just go have a look at a couple of these E55s. Okay, so I'm not 100% sure whose who's, um, E55 this one is, but it's a very nice example for sure. Um, yeah, really cool. Very nicely presented. Really cool. Yeah, and then we got. Uh, yeah, I'm parked over in the tree there. Then we got my E55, which is uh, just a little bit modified, but uh, you know that's the way I like it, so that's the way it is. Um, just a quick walk around, backwards and forwards. Like I said, you know, it's a little bit modified, but uh, that's how I like it, so. All right. It's about, uh, 520 horsepower, um, small block, 727, full manualized, trans brake, nine inch, etc. W2 heads, got Kellogg crank in it. Um, yeah. Okay, another E55 here, we've got Simon's, Simon's Tough E55, beautiful car, just have a bit of a walk around. Alright, that's Simon's Beast, ran some pretty quick quarter mile times too, so really cool. And we've got Wayne's, once again this is an E55, and we've got Wayne's E55 here, he actually, Wayne actually bought this car new, uh, from new, so um, he's actually owned it all of its life which is uh, pretty cool um, unrestored unpainted um, beautiful car um, yeah very standard very standard looking killer so no really cool like I said he's uh, Wayne's had this from from new and uh, then we got Maddie's Maddie's car over here another beautiful E55 um, Maddie bought this I believe when it was like only a couple of years old so yeah this is another Another tough 340 E55. Um, I've actually got the diff, diff for it um, in my shop at the moment. Um, we're going to be doing a uh, big upgrade on that for him. Um, yeah, so uh, yeah, stay tuned for that. So that's Maddie's E55. And we've got another fellas here. I'm, I'm, I apologise, I'm not 100% sure. Or, or, or sorry, I don't actually know the fella who, uh, who owns this car. I know who he is, but I personally don't actually know him. But yeah, beautiful, another beautiful E55. Um, aircon option etc uh, this one's a, a VH um, yeah beautiful car beautiful beautiful car cool and um, yeah and I actually um, 
I was just speaking to a couple of other guys here too, and I, I know they've got E55s as well. So, um, yeah, there's probably more than just uh, the ones that I've just shown here today. So, um, yeah, pretty cool to have all these uh, sort of cars here parked. It's, it's, it's great, for sure. Alrighty, so heading back from the, uh, from the charge today. Um, great to catch up with everybody. A bit disappointed with um, the turnout. Would have liked to have seen a few more charges there. Um, but a bit understandable due to COVID, etc. And, you know, the current climate that we're in can't be helped, but never mind. Saying that, you know, it was great to, uh, to get out and see all our buddies. Um, you know, lucky to even be able to have a little bit of a get together like that. Um, to, uh, to try and celebrate the Charger and his birthday and all that sort of stuff, the anniversary. So, you know, saying that, a bit disappointing on the other hand, it was, it was really good too. So, um, I reckon that'll about do us uh, for this one. Um, until I'm looking at you all next, stay safe and uh, we'll see you next time. Midcoast Diff Shop.